I like what Dr. Pinkson said about the mindset. You know, that's the thing you really have to work on to adjust because you're going into something new. You're going to have no experience there. So you cannot be hard on yourself grace to know that you're not going to know everything and you are going to have to learn and ask for help and be open to just thinking positive um, to continue down that journey. So next chapter should always feel hard or fearful or scary sometimes, but you do it anyways. You just, you do it scared. You do it in fear because yeah. it will it will work out and you will learn and you will, you will look back and say, look what I've done, you know, look what I achieved and you'll be proud. And that could position you to help someone else who is in that position too. So yeah. I like what Dr. King like said about that. Dr. I Pink like that. Said. Okay. Dr. Hey. King, you, you want to back piggyback on that? Yeah, I think uh, faith and bravery. Yeah. You know, that you're pulling from, again, that God given gut inside, and you just have to have faith in that and just uh, just attempt to be brave. Uh, don't, you know, fear will hold you back and it will steal the most potential pleasure and, and, uh, you know, the, the best of you and the growth and, and everything that you experience, fear can really hold that back. You just have to be brave and, and one foot in front of the other every day and just, just keep going. The, the I, I agree with you, ladies. And if I can add one last thing, drown out the noise. Yeah. yeah. You know, there's going to be so many on all sides. There are going to yeah. be people yeah. pouring into you make it. That's why you have to be really slow, slow, slow to speak, slow to share. Yeah. Um, and if you have spoken, try to drown out the noise because I, most of the time people love to impose how they feel about themselves and in a situation um, that uh, in your situation, which yeah. has nothing to do with your ability to do the job. So just drown out the noise. If I can say anything that has been in the past was one of my biggest uh, shortcomings was is that it was very difficult for me to understand how important it was to drown out the noise. So yeah. drown out the noise. Yeah. Um, I wanted to add something to that too. Sure. Um, Cause I'm, I'm very big on the mindset as well, right? Mm -hmm. What's meant to be will be. Mm -hmm. And no matter how much you resist change or you resist whatever is going on in your life, it's going to happen how it's going to happen and it will work out. Mm -hmm. I, I really like that you said that Dr. Pinkson, because I really, really resonate with that. I, I can be a very anxious person. Mm -hmm. I can be an overthinker, queen of overthinking over here. Mm -hmm. um, and so I really do have to remind myself that if it's meant to be, it will work out how it's supposed to be. That doesn't mean sit back and don't do anything about it. Right. That doesn't mm -hmm. mean sit back and say like, well, all these opportunities are going to come to me. Right. You have to put in the work as well, but yeah. you have to trust in yourself and trust in the universe and trust in God that things are going to line up how they're meant to be.